everybody welcome back to another video so today's video is something that's been highly requested for quite a while now a year and a half ago i uploaded a video called my mini ears collection and back then i had five pairs of custom mini ears from etsy stores etc now i have a lot more and people have noticed this and people wanted to see an updated collection because I have some, well I think I have some really beautiful ears and I think people have noticed that so I don't even know how many I've got, I've got a lot, a lot. So I thought I would do an update because I think it's about time and that's what you guys wanted to see so I don't mind talking about things like this because obviously I wouldn't buy mini ears if I didn't like them so I'm going to get straight into it because there's a lot to get through. So I'm going to link my previous video down below so you can go watch that if you haven't seen it already. And the ones that are featured in that video I'm going to kind of breeze through because I've already spoken about them. So I'm going to still show you them but if you want to hear what I have to say about them the link is down below. That's just easier because there's so many to get through. So the first pair of ears that I spoke about before are from Queen Ursula and they are these gorgeous tangled Diamante style ears. So you've got the tower, you've got Pascal on top of Maximus, if it focuses, there you go. And then on the other side you've got Pansy and Flynn. Unfortunately a flower has fallen off, so I'm going to have to glue that back together. But I love these, they are so beautiful. They're so light on your head, and I haven't actually worn them in ages. But here they are, I love them. They're super pretty. Uh, she does some really gorgeous custom made ears and you can get basically anything you want and obviously me being me i got um tangled themed but honestly she does some gorgeous ears i really oh, i really do want another pair i just haven't got around to it because i'm bad at decision making and i feel like ears like this i need to decide something i was thinking hercules style but i'm not too sure the next pair that i showed in my last video are these ones these are floral ears which i haven't worn in a while because unfortunately this like ribbon around the band came off and they became kind of, they kind of hurt. Um, that was my own fault, but they are beautiful. They were from a shop called April and Dinah, I believe, but I think she closed her store quite a while ago. So I don't think you can get these anymore, but I know a lot of different Etsy stores make floor ears and they're just beautiful. These were the Tangled Star ones that I love. Like I absolutely love these. Yeah, I need to look into fixing them because as you can see the, the band, I don't know if you can see this. The band is out and it's painful. It digs into my ear and I don't really want that. So the next pair of ears from the previous video are these Ariel inspired ears. They've got her tail, they've got purple, like a purple glittery bow. Is it going to focus? Thank you. Purple glittery bow and you've got like a dingle hopper here. These are super cute. I think these are like the first custom ears I ever bought. I bought them before mine and Lauren's trip to Florida in 2017 and I just absolutely love them. Um, I can't remember the name of the shop off the top of my head. I'm going to link all of the shops down below, at least the ones that are open, and you can go look. I know you can get a different bow on this and I know a lot of different stores do similar ears like this now, but these are just... They're still one of my favourite ears. They're just so well made and they're so gorgeous. So I'll link the shop down below so you can go check that out because I can't remember off the top of my head. I know it was a company from America, Pfft, don't know, but I absolutely love these. So the next two pairs of ears that I had before are both from Ears Ever After and we've got my Donald ears which you've probably seen a number of times in the vlogs because they're probably one of my favourite. They're kind of getting a bit dirty and horrible now because I just wear them so much but I still love them, they're just absolutely beautiful. Natasha makes some really gorgeous ears. I think these were the first ears or after ears I ever bought. And then the second pair were these gorgeous Marie ears, which I wore to Mickey's Not So Scary in 2017 because I was Marie. And again, these are, these are doing pretty well, but they've been rained on a few times, but I absolutely love both of these ears. Like they're just, I don't know what I'm doing. They're just stunning. I just, I love these. They're just so beautiful. So these are these two, both from Ears Ever After. Her ears are so well made and I just love them so, 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 so much. <laughs> so they're all the ears that I already had and I've already spoken about, so I kind of rushed through them. Um, because the last two I showed you were Ears Ever After, that's going to filter into the new ears that I have from Natasha because I have 
I have, I think, about five more ears over after ears that I'm going to show you. So I'm going to go through them now and talk a bit, a little bit about them more in detail. So the first ears I want to show you are these ears, which I'm not sure if you're better to tell, but these are based on Meg from Hercules. They are absolutely gorgeous, like absolutely gorgeous. Um, you've got a really pretty red red bow with a gold bit. You've got the purple here like her toga and it's just beautiful i love these because it's so nice because you hardly ever see anything hercules sorry i'm just <laughs> you hardly see anything hercules so when these were brought out i was like no i need these i wore them in magic kingdom last year and i don't know if i've worn them since i have too many ears like picking ears for a trip is really hard but these are just absolutely stunning. As a huge Hercules fans, fans, as a huge Hercules fan, I love them. Natasha's ears are very comfortable, and they just easy fit on your head. And I just love these. I just love the sparkles. I also love that not everyone will know what these are unless they know what Hercules is. Like you know, if you know, you know. This next pair are very simple style ears. They are rose gold which you may have seen me wear a few times. I like wearing these when I'm not too sure which is go, which is a lot of the time. The headband's a bit stretched because I think I've got a really big head. They just look like this. They're kind of like the rose gold ears that you can get in the park. However, I prefer, I much prefer these. Um, they're just so sparkly. Super duper sparkly. These are just very simple ears. You can kind of wear them with any outfit, which is why I got them, because sometimes I do struggle. I've got outfit and then I'm like, what do I wear with that? Because I don't necessarily have the character that I'm bounding as or like the character. I don't know. I don't have anything that goes. So these are just nice. They just add a little simple piece of Disney to your outfit. I love them. The next pair of ears are one of my favourite ears and they are these pig ones, which I like Piglet from Winnie the Pooh, who as you, as you may know is my favourite Winnie the Pooh character ever. I love him, my boy. Always loved Piglet. He's just... <laughs> he's so cute so i love these ears again super comfortable nice just really simple you know like they just add something different to an outfit and i just really love them and um, they're made of like a i don't really know the material i don't know if you'll be able to see so they're kind of like really soft but like i just i love them i really really love these i know that you can get the whole 100 acre wood gang on there as well tigger etc poo and all that and they're just they're so nice and i definitely think i'll be wearing these on an upcoming trip again because i've got a cute outfit that i want to that i want to do so these will be coming out again in future vlogs so watch out for them so next up we have these ears which as you may be able to see are fantasia mickey inspired so you've got obviously red material like his gown so is, is it a gown what would you call that a gown a robe You've got like the rope which ties it around here and you've got a blue bow with stars. It did have a moon on it and it fell off. It's fine. It still looks adorable. There was like a moon here which sadly fell off and I lost it. It was very windy. I think this was in Paris. It was windy and it like whoosh, blew off. So sad times but I really like these ears. I think red's quite a hard colour to match with but I really loved them. Yeah, I just, I just love these. I think the idea of them is really cool. I don't think I've ever seen anything quite like these before. I don't know. I just love them. They're very simple, but super nice. I just, I just, every, all of them I just love. So the final pair of ears ever after ears I have are these gorgeous little BB-8 ones. They've got a silver bow and I just absolutely love them. Um, I bought these because I had a BB-8 t-shirt that I wasn't wanting to wear last year at Hollywood Studios, which I did. And I just thought these ears would go so perfectly. And as someone who... I love BB-8. I think he's he's my favourite droid. I love R2-D2, but BB-8 has a little special place in my heart. I really like the orange, white, and yellow. I think it looks really... Yellow? That's... Orange, white, and silver. I really like that colour combination. I think it looks really good. Again, I just love sparkly bows. They're just super duper sparkly. And again, I'll put them on. Well, actually, you can see there's BB-8 right there so yeah i just love love these i do i really like the fact that you can get mini inspired ears with 
characters that aren't necessarily normal Disney characters so you can get Star Wars or um, Marvel, that's the word I wanted to use and things like that. I just really love that idea. So it's really good when, when you want to go to like Hollywood Studios or if you're going to like a special Star Wars thing. Love, absolutely love these. So the next pair of ears follow with the theme of non-Disney but Disney is Spider-Man ears. Me and Laura went to a Marvel soiree at Disneyland Paris last year and I really wanted a pair of Marvel ears. Spider-Man is my favourite Marvel character ever. So I obviously wanted these. With this I remember I could pick the colour bow and I went with blue. You've just got the spiders on either ear and the red and I just think they're I love them. I absolutely love them. Um, Spider-Man loved them himself. I showed them and he loved he loved these because obviously it's all about him. They're super comfortable, really well made, just beautiful. Um, you can see they've got like a really nice um, band and they're just so beautifully made. Like I can't fault these. I mean, I can't fault any of the others I made. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, I just I just absolutely love these and I don't really know what else to say. I might be wearing these in May when I go to Design Paris. Not too sure. I haven't really outfit planned yet, but I think I am because it's currently Marvel season of the heroes. I, th I think that's what it's called. It was Marvel summer of heroes last year. Now it's Marvel season of heroes, I think. Season of superheroes. So I might be wearing these because I love them. So the final three pairs of ears are all from Hannah Marie Magic, who used to have an Etsy store and now she has her own website. I can't remember if th that is the case for ears or after as well, I think. I can't remember. I'm going to link everything down below so it's so much easier for you. I've got three Hannah Marie Magic ears and I'm going to show you them now. So the first pair of ears I have are my Rapunzel style ears. So you've got a lizard's tail here, a chameleon's tail here. You've got a beautiful like rose gold bow. You've got like a, the purple dress and the hair and some flowers. And I just love these ears. They are so beautiful. They're so creative and kind of subtle that like you have to really look to maybe figure them out for like other people walking past, which I really like. Every time I wear these, people are like, what's on your head? And I'm like, okay. Absolutely stunning. So the main difference with these ears are the band is much looser. So they do sit on your head. They're not as tight. So they do wiggle a little bit, which isn't a problem. It's just like a warning what do i want to say just just to let you know they are a bit so they kind of do that sometimes which is not a look really i mean it is a look but not one i want um and oh my hair yeah so they're slightly looser so when it is a bit windy they can fall back or forward because i think they're quite top heavy but they are super comfortable and i think that's just because it's a it's a slightly thinner band around the head which is totally fine and i'm just obsessed with these i've worn these quite a lot um, and her hair's going all straggly. Yeah, that's me. That's my fault. Again, nothing to do with the makers. Absolutely beautiful. Just love. And they're just, oh, they're just lovely. I love them. The next pair of ears I, I love. I know a lot of people might not. But, so these are also from Hannah Marie Magic. These are my sadness inspired ears. You may or may not know, Pixar. Inside Out is my favourite Pixar film. And Sadness is my favourite character. I feel like because I kind of look like her um i've been told this i don't know if that's a compliment or not but i think i look like sadness from inside out and i saw these and i love them i wore i wore them when i went to meet sadness joy and sadness at epcot last year sadness was like kind of freaking out in a sad sort of way um because we were twinning and i just love them i think they're really good for like a bound i think they're really unique because no one else is gonna have ears like this really i don't think and i just i really love these the colors i love blue blue is my favorite color and i just love the fact that these have been made because again you hardly get anything inside out ever which annoys me because it's my favorite pixel film and i want more sadness and joy and bing bong and everything and i just i love these again they're slightly light on the head so they do kind of although these ones aren't so bad if you can see, they, they these ones stay more firmly on your head. I think it might just be the other ones because they're heavier. These are quite light. And I think it depends on your head shape. I have quite a weird head. And also because I have glasses, it pushes the band on all my ears back. So they slightly sit, sit. So they sit slightly differently, but that's okay. Um, but yeah, I love these. The final pair of ears I'm going to show you are my newest pair of ears. And I absolutely love these. These are my Moana 
Mu Muana, Muana, Muana. I can speak, I promise. I'm just, yeah. These are my Moana inspired ears and I absolutely love these. I think they're absolutely beautiful. I just, because again, people don't really know what they are. When I met uh, Flynn and Rapunzel on my last Disneyland Paris trip, they were trying to figure out, they thought it was Pocahontas, which I can get from, oh, I get from this side. But then they looked at it more carefully and realized that it was the heart of Tafiti and the necklace and everything. But oh, I absolutely am obsessed with these. Basically on our February, February trip to Disneyland Paris, I've always loved Moana, it's one of my favourite films, but we kind of grew more in love with Moana because we saw her and we actually met her and then I was like, do you know why I actually want some Moana inspired ears? Because that girl is everything and I love her. So I wanted something to commemorate this and to wear and hopefully I'll be wearing these again on my next trip. Um, but yeah, I just really love these. Again, similar problem, they do slightly do this, which doesn't look too bad. You just maybe have to readjust them if you want a photo, that's fine. But these are just gorgeous and again such a great idea so that is all of my ears I've kind of rushed through them but there's not a lot I can say about them apart from they're amazing I love them I wouldn't have bought them if I didn't love them I wouldn't show you them if I wasn't keen I think all of the shops and all of these makers are incredible I think it's really good to support small stores because they work so hard and they're so creative and just amazing i've not been sponsored i've not been told to say this by any of these people i think they're all great and i think you know i wouldn't wear them all the time if i didn't um yeah i just think they're all fantastic and i know a lot of people always say where are ears from where are ears from where should i get some ears you know and all of these shops fantastic they have such a great range for everybody like there's honestly you throughout all of these shops i'm pretty sure you could find something that is specifically like oh my gosh this pair of ears is so me and i think that's fantastic i think that's great about the internet now that you can go and find custom ears oh you can find a custom pair of ears that's that just screams you and that you can really let out your personality in your outfits and i love wearing ears my collection is definitely going to keep growing but that's fine so i may have to do an updated video in another year and a half and there'll be about 500 pairs of ears but that's fine that is fine thank you so much for watching i hope you did enjoy the video if you have any questions about the ears just leave them in the comments or send me a message whatever i will be more than happy to answer them and yeah i hope you enjoyed it and i will see you very very soon for another video bye